हेलो गाइस शुभमिया सो प्रीवियसली मैंने पीपल आस्क मी दैट हाउ वी कैन फाइंड अ परफेक्ट जी कैम फॉर अ पोको एफ वन विच इज रनिंग ऑन एंड्रॉइड ट्वेल्व और ट्वेल्व एल रॉम्स प्रीवियसली आई मेड वीडियोज वेर आई हैव शोन यू द परफेक्ट जी कैम विच इज सुटेबल फॉर एंड्रॉयड टेन एंड एलेवन रॉम्स बट नाउ यू आस्क फॉर इट एंड यर वी कम दिस इज द जी कैम ऑफ वर्जन एट पॉइंट फाइव विच इज रनिंग एक्सक्लूसिवली ऑन द लेटेस्ट पिक्सल फोन्स and this runs perfectly fine on Poco F1 running on Android 12 ROMs. It got huge amount of features you can't resist using. And also this is stable, won't crash and works perfectly fine. So without any further ado, let's get into the installation of this camera mod and get into the, some of the camera samples and some footages too. Now let's get into the business that is download and installation of this ROM. So basically I read a blog on internet. Thanks to this blog and full credits goes to this blog from Android Sage forum. I will link down the blog in my description below and they have given completely detailed information that what all features are included with screenshots too. And you can just have a look and read it thoroughly. and you will get to know what all they have included bundled inside this one apk so scrolling down here you have to click on this link and you will get android file host link after that you have to just click on download and it will search for the best mirror from where you can download this apk file make sure to download from the android file host link only by scrolling down and no other links as you can see that it's getting downloaded In my case it's already downloaded so let's move to our installation. Once this gets downloaded you just have to click on that APK. Once you click on that it will start getting installed. Once you click on installation. Wait for some few seconds and your app will get installed on your phone. As the notification pops out that the camera app has been installed. Drag this camera app with a shortcut on your desktop and you can see once you open the application you have to allow all the permission regarding storage mic and all the other stuff click on done and here we go you got the latest gcam of version 8.5 let me tell you some basic settings you have to enable such as google advanced white balance hdr plus and all the other basic settings such as this is something as per your preference that what type of resolution you want moving further inside settings Don't touch all these settings uh, until and unless you don't have any knowledge of it. Further on, you will get all these settings. You just have to enable it, such as shoulder tilt lens warning, HDR plus control, and all such things. Moving on, you have also keep this as max resolution to get quality photos and enable video stabilization. Though Poco F1 got EIS, but still you have to enable it. This is some something called as developer setting so don't touch it until and unless you don't have knowledge about it. So let's move towards our basic settings once again. So as you can see this settings were regarding photography and regarding video you will get all such settings you can set to 60 fps you can get 4k thanks to the snapdragon 845 chipset that you can record 4k videos too in 60 fps not to say the auto frame rate is enabled only for fhd and not for 4k because of some reasons take a note that slow motion doesn't work i don't know but since many apks of gcam slow motion crashes in most of the gcam apks and same with this build moving on further in portrait mode again you have to just set all the settings such as face retouching as advanced then you have to enable the advanced google white balance and set other preferences as per your choice the zoom in zoom out at 2x works perfectly fine and there's no issue in it the clarity of the photos also is really really amazing this is something called as night light which is also called as astrophotography again just enable advanced white balance Enable astrophotography mode and you are good to go to click some good amount of stars at night. So these are some of the features which is bundled in just one APK. 
All these features you will get exactly in the latest Pixel device when you open a camera application. So that is something good. So as you can see these are the camera samples which I took and the color, sharpness, contrast and everything else even in video recording looks really really impressive and nice. Also some of the portrait shots I took it's really really detailed and fine and I didn't find any type of issue with it. It really seems like it had been shot from a pixel device but it just shot from a Poco F1. So that's it for this video guys if you like this video must hit that like button also subscribe this channel for more such updates upcoming. Surely try this Gcam mod APK I will link down everything in the description below and enjoy the quality photos on your Poco F1. Until then see you again in the next time. Peace out.